Hello dear, in this video we are going to discuss about different compiler construction tools uh, like as we discussed in the previous video like a compiler is not a single phase like where it takes a source code and directly converts to assembly level code right there are some in between phases involved like it is a step by step process where the uh, source code actually flows into different parts phases for this conversion okay and there are some like when you want to generate a new compiler when you are designing a new compiler there are few packages that are existing like some tools are already existing you can utilize the tool for conversion okay so these six are the known tools that are used for compiler construction one is parser generator a uh, parser generator will automatically generates a parse tree structure okay a parse structure that actually comes in your syntax analyzer right so this parser generator will takes the set of tokens and it will generate sparse tree out of it so that is parser generator and you have something called scanner generator so scanning actually means analyzing reading right so uh, this analyzing a code is done in the lexical analyzer so scanner generator is used to implement lexical analyzer it reads the code and uh, uh, using regular expression de uh, description it returns set of tokens okay and next one is syntax directed translation engine this is used to uh, generate a mesh uh, intermediate code like when the pass tree is given as input this just go through that pass tree and generate some intermediate codes okay so this is this this is called syntax directed translation engine based on the syntactic structure it takes the pass tree and generates some intermediate code and next one is code generator this code generator as it means like it generates the machine code out of this intermediate code okay that is code generator and next one is data flow analysis engine so data flow analysis in this engine in the sense how a data value is flowed in the program this is actually uh, used in case of optimization when you want to optimize something like you have to know the flow of uh, uh, values in a, for a variable or something right so this data flow analysis engine is used to keep track of the data flow in a program okay and finally you have compiler construction toolkits it is an integrated thing that where uh, each and every phase can be implemented as per a request so it is an entire toolkits available so these are all the different compiler construction toolkits that are available for generating any new compiler okay thank you